That's right, Frank. I got a chance to talk to the sweetest lady in a Christine Brooks Bivens. And that's right, she's part of a family that has had deep history in Houston County since the 1850s. And for the past 170 years, the Brooks family has had a profound interest in growth here in the area. The soulful singing coming from Christine Brooks Bivens means more to her than just a song. It speaks of years and years of family history in Houston County dating back to the mid 1800s. I was born 19, January the 22nd, 1922. I'm ashamed to tell it. At 99 years young, Miss Christine is the baby girl of 15 children born to the late Bob Brooks and his wife, Beulah. These are my folks. Papa and Mama. Mama was a midwife. She knew whatever thing it was in the book about catching a baby, white and black. Papa, he was a master. Her papa, preacher Bob Brooks, who was born into slavery, was a well-known minister who traveled from church to church sharing the gospel. He died on Christmas Eve, 1972, three months shy of his 121st birthday. The Brooks have been a staple in Warner Robins for as long as the city has been around. Watson Buller Boy, I know, it was, I know when it was first named, but this place done grow so tell. I don't hardly know it, but I thank God for it. Generations later, with hundreds of grandchildren and great-grands, the Brooks are entrepreneurs, educators, and of course, preachers. Granddaughter Brindette Brooks Anderson calls it the family business. Everybody knows the Brooks. Whenever you say Brooks, everybody knows who you're talking about in the whole middle Georgia area. I think a lot of us left and came back, but this is home. And as the community continues to grow, the Brooks family is happy to be a part of Houston County's heritage. And for Miss Christine, the desires for her and the Brooks family going forward are pretty simple. Well, I just hope to live on and, and, you know, do well. So much full of life right there. You love to see it. Now, Miss Christine's father, Bob Brooks, was actually married three times in his lifetime, and he had fathered 42 children. That's 27 children in the first two marriages, 15 in the last. So the Brooks family name has definitely had an impact here in the Houston County area. Now, reporting from Warner Robins, Marvin James, 13 WMAZ News.